Hey guys, it's Brie. Welcome to A Dose of Reality. Today is Monday, so you all know what that means. It's Manny Monday. But, bare nails, y'all. So, I'm coming at you today with something a little bit different for Manny Monday. I am not going to be doing any kind of actual physical Manny on my nails today. However, when I got home today, I was super excited because I got in the mail my pretty serious nail polish haul. Now guys, I know Manny Monday is supposed to be not necessarily a like haul video day. It's supposed to be just a Manny day. However, this is some pretty serious, <laughs> pun intended, uh, stuff that I got today. So I have seven polishes here. I'm going to show you all of them. I'm not going to swatch any of them right now. I'm just gonna show you them, tell you the names, give you some colors. And what I want you guys to do in the comments, I want you to comment what color you want to see on my nails for the rest of this week's videos. If y'all don't participate, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna be any fun. Please, people, help me out. So, let's get rolling because I'm so excited in case you can't tell. I worked a full day today. I started at like seven. It's seven at night. It's 12 hours later. I've been up since four. This is like, this is excitement over like this. I'm so excited. So first of all, I can't get over like this postcard, like adorable, adorable. So, all right. First polish I have is Ninja Licious and it is not gonna show up super cute on camera. I know that, but it is a black with blue and green little glitter in it and I think it is adorable so that one I wouldn't mind having on my nails for the rest of the week actually none of these I would mind having on my nails for the rest of the week I'm just gonna throw that out there so that is option number one is Ninjalicious the black with the blue and green glitters option two is called Cuddle Bunny it is this beautiful pastel um, violet color uh that is probably not a really good description of it uh violet uh, i'm trying to think of another word besides violet and i can't it's not it's lilac that's the word i was looking for people a camera is not doing this justice at all at all this is gorgeous gorgeous i promise that's cuddle bunny Next, I have Snugglebutt. Can these names be any cuter either? Um, Snugglebutt, which is a dark purple shade, which I think is coming up blue on the camera, which I'm not sure why. Let me try covering up my face. Not that that ever helps. I see so many people do this and it doesn't help. Why do people do this? Why do I do it? Why do I do it? I don't know. Um, yeah, it's this adorable like dark purple shade. So Snugglebutt. Oh, but get it, get it up close and personal. No, you're not gonna focus on that. All right, that snuggle butt. Then I have this is just the regular line, by the way. I have sugar cakes, which is this bright neon pink, and it's coming up more much more pastel on camera than what it is. But it is a very bright neon pink. It is a matte formula. I know that. I remember reading that. Um, so I've never. In my life, worn a matte nail polish. I will say that now, but I will do it if y'all request it. So, and I will not put a super shiny top coat on it just to see how the matte is because I want to try it in its original gorgeousness. So, and then I got the post-apocalyptic princess, that uh, little collection that they did i got three from that and the first one i have is badlands bandit which is beautiful guys it is this blue chromey kind of color and it's actually picking up on camera really really well so this color i love chromes i love 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 chromes and it actually looks like there's on the edges of the bottle it comes across as like a little bit of a purpley violet shade so that is Badlands Bandit. Then there is Toxic Tiara, which is more of a glittery formula. It is this red 
and it has almost like a gold tone glitter to it. Uh, gold tone, silver tone, maybe both actually now that I'm looking at it. It's funny because when I look at it from this side, I get the red with like a gold tone. But when I look at this side, I get more of silver tone, which is kind of interesting. I'll take it. So, and then the last one that I have is called Dropped on the Floor, but did not break. Thank God. Um, so it is called Cherry 2000. And um, I kept this one in the box because I really like this one. And I'm actually like shocked I didn't break it when I dropped on the floor. Thank God it only fell just a short drop there. Um, so this is another chromey kind of color. It is a magenta, maroony, red. Uh, there's definitely uh, some magenta aspect in it when it, you can see it around the edges, but it is definitely a darker maroony type polish. Now, funny story when I got this, um, and I won't keep this video going too long. When I got this on the packaging, it said, arrived in damaged condition. Not what you want to see on a nail polish haul at all. Um, don't know what exactly it was. The box smelled like something had potentially maybe gone to the bathroom on it. I don't know what that means for the United States Postal Service, but thank goodness all of my pretties were intact and still are, even though I'm clumsy as all get out. So those are the seven polishes. I will put the information on them in the description box. Please, please leave me a comment down below here with which one you would like to see on my nails, on these things, for the rest of this week's videos. So I look forward to hearing from you guys. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, never miss a dose of reality ever again. Find me on Instagram and Twitter. I'm Brie51687 and I would love to interact with you in those ways. Also, um, like I said, leave me a comment and I will be back, hopefully, as long as y'all participate with one of these awesome colors on my nails for the rest of this week's videos because I have some awesome things in mind. So I will see you all soon. Bye.